the soul of the skin suit, the body, the Word made flesh, our Lord Jesus Christ, okay, the soul got the Father, okay? Okay, you learn some things when you're getting shot at and when you've fallen down and you've gotten injured on the battlefield and whatever else and you know the fear and the and the, all the emotions that go along with it. Yeah, um, I learned a bunch of things when I was in my 20s. And, you know, it's always funny because usually the people that attack me the most are the ones that, that uh, rarely ever support the ministry. And, you know, people don't need to support me. I don't care. Whatever. That's that's not, you know, some kind of standard. If you support me, then you're my friend. And if you don't, then I, you know, then I hate you or something. But, I mean, 41 people in the month of January helped the ministry out. That's inappropriate. But uh, I'm going to mention the name of a sweet, tender, beloved young brother who I love very much. Well, oh, these days, I'm about to say you have to be crying and bawling your eyes out to be saved. Well, how else see you can humble yourself to the Lord? All these things you see going on, the envying, the debating, the whispering that goes on with these false converts and they're attacking true Bible-believing, God-fearing ministries, what's really going on is they're haters of God. Wouldn't it be proper if he would announce that he the son of perdition, were born on December 25th? Wouldn't it be proper and appropriate that the son of perdition would play off of all the pagan Christmas stuff? Hmm? Wouldn't that seem appropriate?